I'm Gita, I hope you're doing great as always. The time has come, as Midnight Oil sang once in a song, to review the Golden Plexi from Tone City Audio. Why did I check that? Because it says the name there and I just forgot it. Uh, so the Golden Plexi, uh, it's a replica of a Carl Martin pedal. A Carl Martin Plexi, I think the name is. I'll print all that info on screen anyway, so I don't need to remember it. It's a... At the first glance it's a simple pedal. You have gain, volume and tone controls. Nothing unusual with that. Uh, it runs only on um, adapters, no battery compartments here. It's very small as you can see. You will get the measurements on screen as well. Uh, it's uh, almost golden in the color, uh, as you might be able to see here. Uh, it's sturdy built in a metal casing uh, and uh, it contains a big sound. And that's what we're going to listen to right now. So this is a profile from Tone Junkie, it's the Kremlux which is a Fender amp from 1963 and without the Golden Plexi engaged this is how it sounds. Okay, so let's start with everything at 12 o'clock on the Golden Plexi. It's a little bit noisy because 12 o'clock on this pedal is quite a lot of gain. Just listen to this. Middle position. Thank <laughs> you. 
Alright, so I've lowered the noise gate on the camper and changed the settings on the pedal uh, because uh, I mean I'm sitting quite close to the equipment so maybe that has an effect uh, for the feedback but anyway th this is a kind of nice tone. <laughs> As you can see, I have volume at 12 o'clock and gain at around 11, and tone is right now around 9 o'clock. Uh, sounds like this with the bridge pickup. Let's turn that all the way down. As you can hear, the tone control makes quite some difference. We just had it at 9 o'clock, so let's put that at about 11 as well. Sounds like this. second position on the strat which is the bridge pickup and the middle pickup. It's still on the second position on the strat now, so uh, let's see how that sounds. This profile is called Dirty 40 and it comes from SGL profiles and it sounds like this. This is the best setting I can get out of it, really. Now, this might be interesting to see how it goes. This is a more high gain uh, profile from Library Sound and their pack Ruler of Amps. Uh, so, uh, this is how it sounds without the pedal engaged. So, with the gain at 9 o'clock, well, it's noisy as hell and the feedback is there. It's for real? <laughs> 
sound and more noise in the background but I lower the gain now so so here I am with an explorer uh, because uh, I figured it seems like the golden plexi really works well with clean profiles and I guess that would translate into running it in front of an amplifier in the clean channel uh, I don't know exactly why it's working like a preamp or something like that I've read somewhere that it works best with the clean and that obviously is the case so I figured rather than trying out a bunch of different profiles which there will be of course as well kind of uh, I'll toss in this Explorer which is mid-range guitar it's a it's a studio uh, tribute rather <laughs> and uh, then I'll take the really cheap Holly Benton with Texas specials uh, single coils as well but this my friends is how this profile sounds this is a Buddha 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 I'm not sure I pronounced that in English Buddha SD80 from Gold Lion Studio. Without the pedal engaged, this is the sound. the volume it's uh, a little bit noisy but uh, I'm not sure how, I'm not sure how this will translate into the video but in the room it's a major difference in the energy of the sound <laughs> back on the, vo on the, not on the volume, on the tone control <laughs> Okay, 
so this is a cheap Telecaster from Toman. It's a Holly Benton, and I've put in Texas Specials in it. Uh, the profile comes from Daylight Studios, and it's a Splorn Quick Rod, and without the pedal engaged, it sounds like this. So I tried to dial in a tone that's uh, kind of breaking up just about, low gain, and this is it. <laughs> That's a major culprit in this. Let's see how that this sounds. you're gonna get of the Tone City Golden Plexi. Uh, it's a little beast in a golden package, in a small package as well. Obviously it works best with clean tone. Uh, I tried three different gain tones and it just sounded like it was compressed, a compressor from hell. Something like that. It didn't sound good at all. But as soon as you have a totally clean uh, profile for your camper, I guess that would translate into connecting it into your clean channel on a tube amplifier on the front of the amplifier. It, I don't know, it just brings more than one dinner to the table. That's what you could say. Uh, it's wild, it's crazy, it's noisy when you, especially when you increase the volume and the gain and sometimes you just can't control the feedback and I love that. Uh, but, and it's uh, it's just a joy to play it because it's such a wild tone and that's just the point I think that that's why so many people are saying that the Golden Plexi is a great pedal because it captures that wild and crazy tone from the Marshall Plexi that everybody loves well almost everybody so this is a fantastic little pedal that comes to a not too expensive price so I try to show 
uh, how it sounds with more than one guitar, four actually in this case, uh, and I was very happy. I hope I hope uh, both my attitude towards playing it shows through in the video as well as the great sound because it's just uh, it gives you that inspiring tone that makes you just want to keep on playing but I can't because I promised my daughter to watch a video with her I'm not sure which movie I think she's inside the house choosing the movie right now well that's it this is the end of the video thanks ever so much for watching I hope you liked it I hope you don't think I wasted your time uh, if you want to see more craziness like this from me have guitar Magnus is my name uh, then why don't you subscribe to the channel because I need that support uh, and you're also of course welcome to leave a like or even better a comment because I love reading comments and replying back to them uh, so we have well even if you have negative criticism about what I'm doing here feel free to leave it I'm always listening uh, there's always uh, an opportunity to get better you know so at least be constructive if you're negative that, that's my motto or something like that uh, anyway I had a great time playing with this I hope you had a great time listening to it and if you like it go and buy it because it's not that expensive music productive um, music productive no. I can't speak German, uh, but music productive, music productive in Germany keeps these pedals as well as Andertons in the Great Britain. Uh, so why not? Uh, next pedal frenzy, I'm going to couple it up with the Sweet Cream, which I've already reviewed here at uh, Have Guitar, because they say that the Golden Plexi and the Sweet Cream goes really nice hand in hand. So we're going to examine that. In some upcoming video that's it to all of you who do subscribe by the way thank you you are golden indeed uh, thanks for that support so there is a new video out every Thursday never forget about that and uh, hope to see you then and until then stay clean and play really hard goodbye <laughs>